This is the first CBA game open to fans since last month's restart, and the audience includes medical workers and police officers who have been on the front line during the coronavirus pandemic. Guangdong start quickly with the Jiao Ray finding Sonny Weems for the dunk in the Southern Tigers lead 5 0. Second quarter, Hu Ming Xuan drives to the rack for the hoop and the harm on his way to 15 points off the bench for the nine time champions. Beijing chip away with Feng Shuo dishing to Epi Udo, whose inside layup cuts the deficit to six. But the Nigerian-American's night comes to an early end after he lands awkwardly following a collision with Su Wei in the third quarter. The 33-year-old exits with a knee injury, leaving the Ducks shorthanded. Jeremy Lin pulls up for three of his 16 points, but Beijing trail by 12. Guangdong continued to attack as Weems nails this jumper in the lane on his way to a game-high 19 points. Yi Jianlian gets open for an easy three, and the Southern Tigers go on to win 101 to 82, pushing their record-setting regular season record to, nine, to 29 straight games. Du Feng's men will be seeded first in the playoffs and heavily favored to win again, while the Ducks drop to fourth. And these two teams could meet again in the semifinals with fans in the stands. Uh, it was great to have the fans in there, just to hear um, voices other than our own. Uh, it was great to have fans in there. Uh, hopefully going forward, you know, we can get some more of our home fans in there and cheer us on. In other games, Guo Ailun's 32 points led Liaoning past Sichuan to grab third place for the playoffs before Shanghai upset Shandong, who fell to 10th. Stefan Marbury's Beikong Royal Fighters beat the Bai Rockets to finish 7th, while Wang Jilin's jumper in the closing seconds helped Fujian move up to 11th by edging Nanjing, despite Zhou Yong scoring 53 points to set a new CBA record with 1,687 for the season.